story beachgoers want to hear. Right at the start of summer, a confirmed shark attack sent a 16-year-old boy to the hospital. This happened yesterday off the shores of Cape Hanlopen State Park. That's just north of the very popular Rehoboth Beach area. 11 News reporter Lowell Melser has more. Park officials here in Delaware have confirmed that it was a shark that attacked a 16-year-old boy off the waters of Cape Henlopen State Park Monday night. Still, beachgoers that we spoke with don't seem too concerned about it. I don't usually go in that deep, but... You know, I guess you hear about those on and off. It's just kind of a free kind of thing. It was the hot topic of discussion at Cape Henlopen State Park Tuesday. Word that a 16-year-old boy had been attacked by a shark a day before. In my 20-year career with the, with the state, uh, I've never in, never encountered this at any of our state park areas, uh, and even in the local communities, uh, the, you know, beach areas. I don't recall of a documented you know shark bite. According to officials with the Delaware Department of Natural Resources, at around 5 p.m. Monday, the 16. Year old who was not identified claimed that he was standing in about five feet of water when he felt something grab his arm. So he took his right hand and started beating it or pushed it off, smacked it, and it swam away. 11 News found an Instagram account of a boy who claimed that he was the victim and he had posted these pictures of the bite and claimed to be doing okay after spending some time in the hospital. State park biologists and other park officials researched the bite and the area and determined, in their opinion, that it was a sandbar shark like this one that bit the boy. Apparently, they're pretty common in these parts and can get up to six feet long, but are not known to bite people in the water. We looked at the pictures, uh, assessed it, uh, determined you know what we believed it was a sandbar shark. Um, and we were asked to be down here just to monitor the ocean, just for any other unusual activity. Park officials delayed the opening of the beach Tuesday, but later let people in the water, and while most aren't too deterred by the news, they do say they'll be a little more cautious. It makes me nervous for people who have small children who might not be watching them. You, you, you know, you're, you can just see so many kids at one time. It's really hard to take care of kids on the beach, and you've got to have your eyes on them constantly. And that 16-year-old boy is expected to make a full recovery. Park rangers tell us that they will continue to monitor the waters here off of Cape Henlopen all summer to make sure that things are safe. At Cape Henlopen State Park in Delaware, I'm Lowell Melser, WBAL, TV 11 News.